striking talent started to show promise at a very early age. His baby produced a comic which he named The Sunday Toast. <laughs> and this gave his friends and many others lots of laughs. But it was a prelude of things to come. He was still a teenager. He took up karate at the local club. He went on to gain a, a black belt in that martial arts discipline. So there was no messing with David there. But when the schools broke up for the summer holidays, all the family spent at least a week or two at Blackpool. At age 14, they also tasted the delights of the Isle of Man. But his favourite land was Scotland, a place that he knew and would come to know like the back of his hand. Now that seems an appropriate time for me to introduce you to Ted Christopher, who is going to sing us a song which you can all join in with and be in your order of service. William Wallace's victory at the Battle of Stirling Bridge is absolutely vital to the survival of our nation. And the men who lived and died for William Wallace in Scotland are fondly remembered. Well, we've come to say goodbye to a man who lived and died for William Wallace in Scotland. We all know that if Davy had been born back in the days of Wallace, he would have been at Stirling Bridge. And if necessary, he would have given his life for the country that he loved. But Davy wasn't of that time, he was of our time. And we were the privileged ones. We were the people who got to know the man himself and got to call him a friend. It's hard to think that that smile and that laugh are gone and that I'll never feel that bear hug again. There is a tradition in parts of Africa that when a great warrior dies, that the rest of the tribe sing to them. They believe that they're singing the spirit home. Now I don't doubt that Davy is up there listening to this. And he's probably with his new pals, Willie and Robert, and all the rest of the great Scottish heroes. And I can just see him, he'll be saying, Come here, guys. Look at this. Behold. <laughs> The spirit of Scotland remains strong. Well, David, what we're going to do now is each and every one of us, <coughs> with all our hearts, we're going to sing your spirit home. If I should become a 
Yeah. Uh-huh.